Honey, I'm home. Billy, dinner's ready. <laughs> Emily, you got some splaining to do. Hi. Today we're making dinner. But as you may have noticed, it is a little different looking than our usual dinner. Yeah. We recently were curious about molecular gastronomy, which is what, how do they describe it? The science of food or something? Yeah, the science of food. Science. Or cooking with science. I've seen it that way as well. <laughs> so we got some agar agar powder and we decided to give it a go. Yep. I got my apron on here, so let's get cooking. Orange. Yeah. All right, so I screwed up and deleted the original footage for the balsamic vinegar uh, caviar. So instead of having it not done, we decided to reshoot it this morning. Um, so that's why I'm in the screen. Emily's actually behind the camera right now. Say hi, Emily. Hi, Emily. <laughs> so. What we're doing is we have two thirds cups of vinegar and a, uh, how'd you call it? A hefty? A heaping, a heaping half teaspoon. A heaping half teaspoon of the agar gar. And then, so you have the balsamic vinegar and the agar gar. So we're gonna bring this to a boil and then we're gonna drop it in little droplets in uh, oil that's been in the freezer for at least a half an hour. We actually had it in there all day, so hopefully it still works. It should be fine. So we get it to a boil, set it aside for a few minutes, let it cool down a little bit, and then drop it into the cold oil. Vinegar, when it's hot or boiling, is like, attacks your senses. Extra so, powerful smell. Yeah, it's got a really extra powerful smell. So if you do try this at home, be ready for that. All right. So we let it sit for five minutes after boiling and we're gonna go ahead and give it a shot. Fingers crossed. That better? A little bit. I like how like I could shoot out a stream, but it still comes out in its own little bubbles. <laughs> and we're not sure if it worked. to continue the solidif the process. solidification. So some of them. Just them. Yeah, it worked. It's not as good as the first one. Whoa. Doesn't that look delicious, folks? <laughs> it doesn't look like a dirty toilet bowl. The concept is still there. <laughs> How do we get this out again? Drain it again. Did you drain it over the sink or something? I'm gonna try to get these ones out. Sure. It's our originals. Now, can you tell which one's the original and which one we did? Ha, ha, ha. Oops, once again, wasn't really shooting it. <laughs> I'm gonna have to do a lot of editing. Yep. You're welcome. It turned out 
out okay though. I mean, I mean, I mean it yep. looks weird. Find the biggest one you can because you were insisting on making the big ones. <laughs> Maybe that one? That one, big one? <laughs> I'm gonna go with this. Now eat it! <laughs> oh no. <laughs> These are really delicious on top of a caprese. Yeah, but by themselves. By themselves, they're very, very strong. It doesn't hit you at first, but then it's like... Put this bag in the fridge. Gonna use that for my sandwiches. Sandwiches? Sandwiches! We'll make some good sandwiches over here. I'm not gonna show the contents of our refrigerator. Nope. Alright, ready? We're done. The end. Wait, wait, show this. Why not? <laughs> saw my finger. Got solid and it's like a jello. Yay. Oh, gross. Oh, God. And All right, so for dessert, we're going to have some spaghetti fruit. Fruit spaghetti. Strawberry spaghetti. Strawberry spaghetti. Well, I blended up a regular sized thing of strawberries with a little bit of water to make it blend. Added a little sugar just to sweeten it up a bit and a heaping teaspoon of our agar agar powder. I stirred it all up and now we have it boiling here. And I'd say it's ready to take off the heat. I'm just gonna let it cool and thicken for a couple minutes here, I think. And then we're gonna make our noodles. All right, now we're gonna pull the puree into a syringe. Oops. That's some thick stuff. It's not that it's thick, but it's not very deep. As you can tell, Henry's very enthousi enthusiastic about this. Probably enough. We probably don't want to do too much because these tubes aren't that big. Now you're gonna take. So we're gonna use this tubing here, and we're gonna plug it into the end of this bad boy. Get close. More than I know, I know. Appears to be giant air pockets in it. Hopefully, there's not air pockets in it. Boom. Alright. Let's see if we can't take that off. We'll get you another tube. What's going on? Ah, I'm making messies. <laughs> We're making uh, spaghetti spheres. <laughs> We're putting this into like icy, icy cold, cold water. water. Jinx. Dang it. <laughs> <laughs> to let them get nice and hard. Yeah, yeah. And ratatouille. <laughs> well, we'll let <laughs> made a little too much. <laughs> well, we let these set and then we just empty those and use them again. I guess that'll work. We're gonna let them sit for a few minutes. Yeah. All right, so it's been a few minutes and we're gonna try to spit the spaghettis out of these tubes here. This is time for the interesting part. Yeah. We tested this before, but we're trying a little something different now. Let's see Are if we, we can, here. But we did more agar gar and cause it was breaking up a lot. Not your end. That's... You want me to do the pushing part? <laughs> this is getting ridiculous. Here. <laughs> Boo. Boo. Ready? Whoa! Ah. 
<laughs> it's like a it's more solid. See, we added a little bit more gargar, -gar, and it's like you can you can pick it up. When we first tried it to make sure this was actually viable, it was falling apart. Like I didn't use nearly enough of the gargar. -gar. Now we have yeah. yummy worms. Yeah. Yay. Daddy. Daddy. <laughs> yeah, daddy. There you go, honey. Go, Dada. For me. I probably should have. Oh, here goes nothing again. <laughs> Gotta use the belly. <laughs> this must be working. <laughs> it's working. It's working. <laughs> slow it down. Uh oh. Oh, it hurt. Look, look. <laughs> so exciting. Oh, oh, oh god, it's... <laughs> oh, oh. <laughs> so oh, that was the good piece. I don't, I don't know where to put it. Uh, the trash? <laughs> <laughs> we gotta reset up these noodles. <laughs> Let me wash my hands real quick. So I think we're going to try and make a couple more noodles and then we're going to have some dinner. Ooh. Ah. All right, so now we're going to try our creations. I'm just not sure how we're going to keep the caviar on our utensils. I mean, usually have yours eaten with a spoon, but then how would we get everything else mm. in it with a spoon? Mm. Maybe we can use the tomato to kind of keep it. Just kind of balance it. Yeah. It's just a like big old there. balancing act. Nom. Ma. Okay, I get Nom. up on the basil. Nom. Meow. That. That. He's saying, that's, that's. <laughs> the combination with everything else, I didn't even really notice the Look vinegar. Back. That's good, because that vinegar is really yeah. strong. On its own, it's too like, much. Talk about sour face. Here. Uh, <laughs> um, yum. Here <laughs> I got a little bit of vinegar on that one. Yeah, I'd give you a little bit more than I'd had because I didn't feel like I had anything. Hmm. That was all ice cream. Bite! 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 You gonna bite? That's actually really good. It's not my favorite thing ever. <laughs> I really like it. <laughs> I mean, it's not terrible. Okay, so I definitely kind of feel like molecular gastronomy is uh, unnecessary extra steps. It's like taking 10 extra steps to make your food harder to eat. What? Molecular what? gastronomy. What? My <laughs> food is right the way it is. Think of what we've decided. With that being said, we are going to shoot more molecular pastrami videos in the future. We are going to try one other recipe that we need. What? We plan on, I what? think, what? maybe testing what? first, what? probably. What? Eh, might be more fun to not test it. That's our take on uh, molecular gastronomy. Very interesting. I think it's fun, but it is hard to eat. It's about as fun as cooking. Blech. Especially with the noodles. You'll see it's in the video. It's about <laughs> as fun as 10 extra what? dishes. <laughs> I love 
Billy and he loves me. We're as happy as two can be. Oh, we may quarrel, but then how we love making up again. Billy kisses like no one can. I'm his missus and he's my man. And life is heaven, you see. Cause I love Billy, yes, I love Billy. And Billy loves me. Farts. We're making dinner farts? Yes, we're making dinner farts. <laughs> <laughs> farts usually come after dinner. Not these ones. <laughs> They're pre-dinner toots. All right. <laughs> We're going to fill up the whole <laughs> thing before we get our intro.